Hi, everybody. Hi. It's a friend of mine here again. Still got, got me cold. <laughs> still got a little bit of a cold floating around. But, uh, yeah, it's getting well, there. It's, yeah. Get, it's getting there. It's getting there. It's getting there. So um, we thought we'd uh, do a little bit of a, obviously a van thing. We're in the van. What a great job somebody did on it. I wonder who it was. I wonder who it was, yeah. So we're in the van, and we've been living in the van now, solidly now, for three and a half months. Yep. We haven't killed each other yet. No. He's got a killed. mark on his head. That was off a boat the other day, that was, yeah. Bit of a Gorbachev. Gorba a bit really. of a Gorbachev, yeah. That's what he saw, that is. Uh, yeah, we just thought we'd do a, 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 van, a van thing, really, um, on hates, disasters, dislikes, loves... Um, a three months living in the van. We know there's vanners out there that have lived out in the vans a lot longer than we have, but yes, three months living in the van. So we haven't scripted any of this, have we? No. Just like all our videos, there's no script. So um, can I just interrupt? Have you have you got a ghosty thing going on? It's it's a halo, I think. <laughs> it's a halo. Or, yeah. or if that's shot, sorry, if that's blinded you, <coughs> there's a spot. There's a an LED right there, so it, it looks like... You probably would have been better off putting the back ones on. Huh? Yeah, um, so people have been shouting, keep away from the light. For you Poltergeist fans, you'll get that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's a bit of a, <laughs> bit of a spot. And it's, yeah, it just reflects. I could put a cap on, I suppose. Why do you put the back ones on and put these ones off? Because then we'll be in silhouette. You do? Yes, the light's a bit at the back. Okay. So anyway, anyway moving, okay, on. moving on, after I was rudely interrupted. Sorry, bit change. Uh, yeah, we're just going to go through some things. What we found living in a van, and, and our living in a van is made up of three sort of things, isn't it, I guess? Is it? Yeah, you don't know what I'm thinking, do you? No. So one of them is um, based here in the marina when we're working. So we have... Um, when we're going down. I think that's just a screw. I don't know, that's weird, that is. <laughs> I don't know where the film's doing that. We'll find out in a minute. Um, our screen's just going dark and light, dark and light. Mm. I think it might be... Maybe it's the reflection off my head is screwing it, screwing the scent. Anyway. Uh, is it? It is. <laughs> stay there. Stay I, can, I can see me now. If I stay there, it's really... Okay, that's a bit weird. As soon as I move, our screen goes dark. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, that's weird. Yeah, um, yeah if, if I'm blinding any of you guys, then I, I do apologise. <laughs> if you get a glint and whatever. So, yes. Before Excuse I was... me. I'm just going to try something. Is that better? Well, now we've got more shiny lights behind us. Okay. I'll try and I'll try and bounce the, the light the, my light. The <laughs> light. Go on, anyway. <laughs> three things. Three things. We in the marina, it's when we're generally here working. Uh we do some wild camping and we parking up at pubs yep. uh, as well. Pubs um by the side of the coast somewhere. We've done that a few times. We've done that quite a lot, haven't we, since yeah. since we've had the van. And the odd campsite, I guess. We try and pick the, the, the Sorry, was you not getting the, your full? That's better. <laughs> um, yeah, so, some campsites and, and that as well. So three, three sort of things we sort of wonder in and out as we see fit. Sometimes campsites are when we want to do our washing and showers and stuff, isn't they? But even then, the campsite we stayed at the other night in Brixton was seventeen pound a night with no nice. with no electric, and it's nice and parking was six pound for four hours so it, sometimes you have to balance all that sort of stuff up didn't you but anyway it's not about that really no. it's about what we find in living in the van how that's working out for us why we waited for our bow moon join and um ha yeah how's that working um so um something you love about living in the van the freedom the freedom get up and go yeah, that's, that's... You don't have to pack anything because everything's here. So you don't have to think what you need. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, everything's here. Yeah, everything's here. Yeah, we take here. our house with us. 
And a prime example of that Absolutely. really was we went to see the football yesterday. So that didn't. That, we took the van, parked it outside the pub. We sort of fell out the pub at silly o'clock and uh, straight into the van. Yeah, and that's why I'm on black coffee. And that's now. why we're drinking black coffee now. <laughs> Although, as. What? You're upsetting the camera when you do this. Okay. Um, although she has just had two bottles of wine with a Chinese buffet. I haven't had two bottles of wine. Or well, bottles, no, not bottles. Oh, yeah, I'll be on my back. Um, <laughs> I've had two glasses of wine. She's had two glasses wine. of wine. Very large ones, glasses, but yes, yeah, she's had two glasses of wine. But yeah, um, two glasses like now of she's wine on a black coffee. Dinner. Makes it sound all saintly, but she just had two glasses of wine. But anyway, I've had two pints of beer. There you go. Um, so yeah, freedom, that's, that's pretty good. Yeah, Let's not wander off too much. Freedom and not having to pack and not having to think what I need because it's already in here, what yeah. I need. So it's nice just to get in, turn the key and go. Okay, okay. so freedom is one, one of your ones. I think that's obviously one of my ones as well. Yeah. We, we like just taking our house wherever we go, so that's great. Um, something else we love. <laughs> <laughs> yeah um, um we, we I, I think we love we, i don't really mind living in the van i, I don't either it's hard to put a, i think no, that's why we both pause i think there. as a woman most people say to me how do you cope how do you cope in that small space blah 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 you, you read all that didn't you but i don't care it's almost a bit when, when we're talking about positives it's almost just become the norm mm -hmm. And I think I, I think if we had a mind to, and obviously we'll be hopefully on the continent in Spain and stuff for the winter, so that'd be three months in the van as well. Um, it's just become the norm to us, hasn't it? Yeah. So it's hard, it's hard to... We I love find the it hard to sit still here because I just want to go somewhere different. We, we find it hard just to stay. Yeah, that, okay, so that's... The, that's the, yeah, maybe, it's maybe that's... Job, I'm, I'm thinking our negatives might be a longer list. And that doesn't mean that that outweighs the positives. Mm. It just means the negative ones are, are, are sort of in our mind a little bit more. Yet um, it's become just so the norm. Yeah. We just cook. We just do everything. We well, we just do everything everybody else does, really, don't we? Yeah. We even watch yeah. obviously watch movies on the laptop and things like that. So we haven't got a shower in our van, but luckily we've got the facilities in our marina, so we can use the washer, dryer showers everything here we got a toilet i can use my air dryer when i want to dry my hair if i don't i don't now I sometimes use, you you'll have a shower what, I can wash use your hair cheap straighteners but i can't use me good straighteners unless we're hooked up to electric yeah which we're not in the marina um yeah we're not we're not up to electric we're still off we're still very much off grid that's that's mm. a good point actually we're still very much off grid so we're just running off two leisure batteries really and it's 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 enough, isn't it? There's yeah. no there's no we don't struggle with power or anything. In fact, you had the vacuum right. plugged into it the other day, didn't you? Just giving the va the van a a bit yeah, of a spruce up, a tidy up and yeah. stuff. So if you get all those base things done first, right first, then it becomes really easy. It's surprising. I think much... I think since not working in the corporate world as such now, I don't actually have to think about what I've got to wear. Either. I know that sounds probably strange, but, you know, I had to have like a uniform and it's got to be look obviously nice and ironed and blah, 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 which it did, obviously. But now it's like, I don't know, I just find things that I go in. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I can't you know, remember the last time just, any of my, any of my it clothes It just feels mine. easier. Sometimes I it, think it is easy. It's almost like um. It just feels a little. What, what is that? What is that word? It's like uh. It's like I got to think of anything. It's relieving you of all those things as yeah. well, isn't it? All those day-to-day -day mundane things that most people get on with, and we just don't seem to have to. We live quite basic in the van, I think. Mm. I don't think about. I haven't got a long mirror, so God knows what I look like when I go out sometimes. <laughs> so. Got some pictures if you want. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Yeah. But no, but you know what? I really ain't that bothered at the moment. It don't really bother me. No, no. There's, there's not many. It's just become the norm. Yeah. I referred it as when I was up in Norwich the other week. I said, you said, I think I phoned you or something. And I just said, I'm just on my way home because I was up there with the van. The family was at her daughter's. And, and it, it hit me. It hit me what I'd said. I'm just on my way home uh, from a watering hole, obviously. Mm. Um, and it, it is, it's just, it's just, it's just home and the norm, and I think it's surprising how much space 
and things that the world doesn't need. Mm. Clutter. Clutter and stuff. We've been talking to a few people lately. And again, we know eco warriors, but everybody's talking about that sort of stuff. And you look at all these big houses built on fresh fields and stuff. I hate that. And you just think, well, nobody's really getting the real core no. issue, are they? We don't need a bloody big house. So let's stop doing that and let's build some little eco houses, you know, with solar panels and stuff on. Unfortunately, we or you who are watching this probably can't change the that no you can't so, you can't change it but it's it's just it just shows you, you how wished, much you, you wish the, the world would yeah. wake up a little bit and certainly the uk it. not the world yeah. maybe but certainly places like america you know we love the states and stuff but it's all very more 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 bigger 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 and and it's the same it's it's the same here and and you just think you don't need it we survive on solar panels and two bloody batteries mm. And we really don't need anything else, you know. Yeah. Okay, we've got gas. We've got gas that lasts us like, I mean, I'll put a kiss of death on this now. That's lasted us like four, five months. And we know it's running out. I think, I'm thinking <laughs> think it's running out. Um, but you don't need very much. <coughs> so why have all those things? Why have a lot house that you've got to heat? Why have, anyway, we, we're waffling on. But this small space really has just become so easy for us. Mm. And I think and it's good for us because when we go on the narrow boat, the narrow boat will actually feel quite big. Mm. So okay, it's just the norm for us now. It, everything, every, all of that is positive. Negatives, there are a few. There are a few negatives, aren't there? Go on. Well, one, one for me. One for me was when um, when we was both ill this week. Oh yeah. There's no there's no getaway. So um, when Fran's coughing, she wants to probably sit 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 up or you know, you know maybe if you was in her house, you you'd go downstairs. Yeah. make yourself a drink maybe sit on the sofa or something like that and this when when you when you're poorly in the van there's there's nowhere to go is there no. there's that you you are stuck yeah you are stuck and that's been i wouldn't say it's been difficult but it's been yeah it's one of those things you when know when you feel so, ill you just want to be comfortable you just want to be comfy and, and watch daytime telly or something yeah. shite but um obviously yeah. we don't do that but that's been one of the negatives i think this this week um Another negative for me really is just being what I, I, I even on the boat I used to lie on the floor a lot, hadn't I? She'd have a sofa and I'd be like a dog on the floor. Uh, but I actually quite like that. That's my way of you know stretching out, and because of the way we sleep, we sleep across the van as well. I don't have that stretch room where I can just like loaf, yeah, and um, and stretch out a little bit. So maybe maybe I'm missing missing the you know, comfort a little the, bit. The comfort yeah. just a just a little yeah. bit. But having said that, you know, we we sat outside in the van in the sunshine. They must think we're like, <laughs> <coughs> we, we, we almost set up camp here, don't we, in the marina? We've got big jack chairs and we're having a beer and chilling out or doing whatever. We was even playing music out the back of the van with a laptop the other day, yeah. the speaker on it and stuff, annoying people. <laughs> but, you know, I mean, all those, all those are positives. So, yeah, negatives, negatives. I <sighs> think constant running water because we have to keep filling up, don't we? Yeah, that yeah. So that the water That's probably lasts us about three or four days, doesn't it? Before we have to go and empty yeah. it. And yeah, I'm I'm okay with it because that's the way we yeah, designed it. Sorry. But obviously, the water runs out always yeah, in the morning, morning when you want that first. Put the kettle on for the first time. Well, no, we don't run out in the morning. It's just that you can't be asked to change it overnight. You say I'll do that tomorrow, and then it's the morning, and then it's run out. I didn't realise that was going to be my fault. <laughs> who knew who knew but yeah there's that one um the toilet as well we've noticed as it's got warmer um it can get a little bit whiffy if you're not keep on top of it so we have to keep on top of it so we sp spray the bowl and we use the the eco mm. blue stuff as well and that's that's we, we've just upped the dose on that a little bit and we put a bit more of that in because we were noticing with the warm temperatures, that was getting a bit... Uh... Well, we don't use it for number twos, do we? Oh, no, no, it's only ever for wee-wees. We don't use it for anything else. No, we use the marina. We, well, we all, <laughs> wherever we are. We use a pub. No. Yeah, we use whatever. And when we're talking about showers as well, you know, when we're out and about, we've gone into the leisure centres and had a swim. I had a shower first, for anybody that might spot that. Have a shower first, and then, yeah, then you'll have a proper shower, and that when you come out, yeah. can't you, and all that sort of stuff. So we've done things like that. Mm. We know people that go into gyms and stuff, have a little bit of a workout and have a shower as well. Yeah. Or just use the shower itself, you know. 
Mm. Some people have a gym membership for like 20 quid and they're all over the place. So, yeah. so none, none of that is really good. We were trying to, else, we're but... trying to think, we're trying to think of, we said, we're not going to, we're going to talk about it on screen, positive and negative. Let's go. And we've gone. Hmm. I wish our fridge was bigger. Yeah. Yeah. We were for sure. Yeah. Like, we, we wish, we wish the fridge was we've bigger. Got, we've got a proper, is it Dometic? It's a Dometic CRX, Dometic CRX 50. But they are quite small. Yeah. And we we do like a lot of fresh stuff, don't we? We do like our fresh food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. More yeah. than frozen, really. So we. That might, that might. I think, yeah, by choice, if I could have had a bigger fridge, I think I would have gone for a bigger fridge. Yeah, they, they do come in bigger. There, there's always a trade off, isn't there? Because mm. you'd lose more storage space. But yes, yeah, maybe a bigger fridge. You know, you can get the twelve volt like from Inlander and stuff that you use on boats. Would have gone in. Would have, we could have done. So maybe that might have been something. And they would have been roughly about the same price actually. Mm. So there wouldn't have been a lot of thing there. Yeah, the fridge, the fridge, the fridge is def is probably one. If Dometic want to donate one, donate one to us. It would fit in there now. I'd make it fit. <laughs> We're taking a chainsaw <laughs> to the woodwork here. <coughs> Yeah, so, so that, that is a bit weird now, isn't it? It's a bit weird because we're thinking about negatives and there's not very many. The oh. positives are we are perfectly happy. That is the positive that sort of covers all the positives, doesn't um, it? We've been in here like from the winter, so and we've had the fire on and he's cooked me, cooked me to death. <laughs> I can't breathe in here. There's a song somewhere and there she's hot and she's cold and whatever. That's, that's, that's her all over. One minute she's... But, but yeah, no, I've not been a, I've not been hot or cold, if you know what I mean. I have, I have been hot and cold. <laughs> All in the same ten minutes, really, hot and cold. Yeah, the, the, I know the, what I mean. <laughs> the log, the log burner certainly works for us, and the good thing about the log burner is you're not cold in here. You, you're definitely not cold. And what what we we've we've sort of got used to that over the winter period. We were just putting far too much yeah. fuel in, and 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 a. Th that's bit, about that's about three kilowatts if you really get it going it's, really it's too nice. much so now all we use is like a little bit of a like half a coffee oh, log yeah, or yeah. just a bit of do you know some just a bit of kindling and some bits and pieces you only need to like take the chill off and then it's warm again isn't it? once you've took the chill off you're yeah. okay again there's no there's, there's no big deal unless so. you're in the arctic obviously <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the thing. If we're up in the Pyrenees in the winter time, we, we might. It might be different. That yeah. might be different. We might. Well, yeah, we were fine. It wasn't a cold winter yeah. though, was it? Really, yeah. this year. So maybe, maybe the next year we will use that more. But we haven't used it very much, have we? This year. I'll go negative. Oh. Again, probably more about him <laughs> than the van. I like fresh air in the van. He don't like to open the bloody vents in here. The vent is always open. It's one of those that's always open. You get me coffee. You need to open it. Just, just, just a point of order for bloody madam here. <laughs> She's got slidey windows, one right by her ear hole. Yeah, you moan it was too cold. I wouldn't. I always say to you, open the window. Or you like, moan that the, if the rain's coming in the wrong way, it'll wet the pillow or something. Oh, if it's raining, that's different because those will. Yeah, but it can, it can rain and still be hot in here. I still like a bit of fresh air. You'll be sleeping outside at this rate. <laughs> See how fresh you like it then. <laughs> I think I think that is, to be fair, that's probably a valid point anyway, is we've just got the one fan here and we've seen some fans, they have the two Max Air ones. Yeah. Um, it's only a bit of black on them. Anyway, um, we, we might, thinking back now, it might have been of an idea to put one of those um, skylights and put another one. Above the bed. Above the bed there. Above the bed there, you know, so that might have been. But to be fair, on, on the warmer nights, we've opened those two side windows that we've got on the van. And to be fair, that, that's enough fresh air and you've got the bug nets in there as well, so nothing comes in. So, uh, and we, we, I can't think of anything. I'm just trying to think now. That's the thing. We're, we're pushing for things that we find negative and there's, not, there's just not very many. I don't think you can ever have enough storage. Especially for my clothes. Well, even mine as well. I mean, that one, that one, that cupboard there is just full of my t-shirts and stuff. And of course, when you you want a t-shirt, you're like, I know it's in here somewhere. Mm. And you end up taking the lot out, looking for it, and then you end up folding them back up individually to put them back in. But it's, yeah. do you know, some it's 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 picky it's and it's not very much negative thing. Yeah, it's not very much of an anything, is it really? So no, we're fine. 
Living in a van, yes. Um, I'd recommend it. Don't and tell it. Fair, don't, don't, don't know. We need to think of lots of negatives so people don't do it. Yeah. And don't buy boats either. I you won't like it. People are doing it though. That's the thing. Yeah, it's all people over. are doing it. It's all over. We, we used to look at vans now and think, oh, should we convert that one? We were that close in buying a, a bigger van rather than having a boat, weren't we? Yeah, we nearly did actually. We nearly didn't buy a boat and, and just bought a bigger van and just cleared off. Mm. We nearly, we nearly did that. Oh, um, I think we for, would have been a bit poor in five years. Ago. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. For for clarity and <laughs> stuff, you know, that's the the boat keeps us grounded. Even though you're on water, strangely enough, keeps us grounded to a certain area. So we come back, do our work, and clear off again. So, and we've, it's a, it's more of an investment. You know, you you know, with cars, vehicles, you lose money. You always yeah, do, yeah. don't you? Yeah. So they'll so probably they'll probably be some... more of a money investment to plummeted into the into the boat really. yeah they'll easily be 70 grand invested in that boat and that boat hopefully will be likely worth 90 plus it unless the, the, the bottom comes out of the market a little bit which it probably will so still you know you're not, you're not your money's not going anywhere still, our money's safe in it. your money's not going oh, anywhere so that's why we did that really because we know if we had that money from our old our other boat We'd have just cleared off, parted like crazy for five years, and come back, and we'd have had nothing. So and then it'd be, what do we do now? Yeah, what do we do now? <laughs> yeah, I'd I'd be obviously early sixties then, and thinking, living in a van, got no, and we'd have no options either, would we? So while we've got the boat, we've uh, we, we've, we've always got options. We can always change, chop because we 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 love the finances to do it. But uh, for, for yeah, um, maybe this is worth pointing out as well. Me and Fran, we every, everything we have is pretty much here. here. <laughs> I don't well, yeah, this is obviously one of them, you know. But uh, we don't we don't have we don't have pensions from places. We don't have money coming in from other places, do we? So we've both been stung by our exes. We, yeah, we've we've been we've been stung a, a little bit, and and I was. Yeah, with that game too deep, I, I was actually I was I was ripped off by a pension company, and any money I did have saved in that, uh, most of that went down the toilet with them. But um, anyway, that's a long story. But you know, in some ways, I'm I think I think it's a good thing, weirdly, because those roads have all led us to here, haven't they? Mm. And and I think we we are we're possibly infinitely more happier. Um, doing what we're doing now than if we was living in a house, paying a mortgage, you gas bill, you, uh, I, I, you know, neighbours you, you know don't you, like or speak got to. you've to work to, to fund all that, ain't you? We'd never looked, at, you'd never have looked at a different way of life, would you? <laughs> no. And it, it's, it's become my career um, f for quite a while now, hasn't it? You know, just, just working on boats. That sounds glamorous. It's not. But... Um, but yeah, we 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 sort of we sort of have to earn everything we get, and we, we yeah. then nobody gives us anything. No, we haven't no. got those we pensions. Work we work for got. everything we've got. So money money can be tight for us at, at times. We we don't have all that all, all of that, and I'm okay with that. I, I just I just thought it was maybe worth just pointing that out. I mean, to, to be honest, Christmas time before Christmas, Martin had a very good job. I had a very good job. We had decent money coming in. But we threw it away, didn't we? Basically. We threw it away. <laughs> we just like thought then, time for a change and there comes a time where you have to jump or shut up. Yeah. And we've And we yeah, jumped. We jumped and we took the plunge and give the corporate world a tatty boy, didn't we? Yeah, and... I do miss some of that still. I miss yeah. some of the guys that the company used to work for and um some of the challenges as well. There's lots I don't miss. But uh, I do miss some of it. Mainly the money. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely miss the money. Yeah. I definitely miss the money. But, but yeah, it's took some adjustment, and we are still adjusting to it. To be fair, I don't think we'll adjust properly this year anyway, because no. it's it's almost not, it's not a normal year for anybody, is it? But it's not a normal year for us because of selling our one boat, living in the van, the narrow boat coming, um, having money in the bank that you think you've got tons of that you ain't. moonshine is going to drink all of that. Yeah. So. Um, it's, a, it's, a, it's an odd sort of year, isn't it, for, yeah. for, for us? And it is for everyone, like I said. But, uh, anyway, we've waffled on, have we? You've waffled on again, yeah. So, yeah, we just wanted to give you a, a, a quick living in the van kind of thing. Um, yeah. 
Yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's it. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, if um, it's not a bad thing, if you're thinking about it, screen. just do it. I think a lot, of pe- a lot of people are short. think life's too short. Like a lot of people now are thinking of different ways of different means live of doing more, things. Work less. Work less, live more. Exactly. Exactly. So yeah, we'll be ta- we'll be saying Tatty bye then, and uh, we'll see you soon. Uh, yeah, we're getting an update on our now about soon, so that will be good. Won't it? So. Might do a visit, Adler. We're going to try and do a visit to okay. Aintree. Um, I might well, go. We might not go now until it's painted, Adler. Uh, uh, no, we did say we wait till it's painted. Made. Yeah. So, and that that'll be a final sign off and stuff. So anyway, we did try and get an update today, didn't we? But no luck. I think they're all on go over. <laughs> I think some of them haven't rolled in today because of the football yesterday. <laughs> so we can get much uh, no replies, <laughs> <laughs> which so is fine. We don't mind that. Which is fine. So yeah, just to, like I say, just a quick thing about living in the van, and then straight <laughs> the only conclusion we've come to is, well, we it's like just, it. we like it. <laughs> It's fine. We like it. We love it. So we yeah. do it. Yeah, so that's it. Okay, so see you next time. Um click that subscribe button if you like. Yep. Our numbers are slightly climbing a little bit, aren't they? Give us a thumbs up if you like. Um and we'll see you next time. Yep. So see ya. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye.